Good afternoon, everybody, and welcome to the SMH Group Stadium for this afternoon's Van der Almond National League game. It's Chesterfield, the league leaders, versus 23rd place to Absolute United. Armando Dobra, Greg is wide on the left hand side, but uh, a good challenge going in there. Dispossession Dobra, and a chance now for Rakish Bingham, the number nine, taking on Williams. Still Bingham. Because the shot in Oak, Rakish Bingham has scored. 44 seconds into the game, and Epsley United have taken the lead. The ball played across the field to Rakish Bingham, who took on Tyrone Williams. And he got round Williams and fired into the bottom corner past Harry Tyra. It's a good ball throw and a chance here for Edson now. If he can get past Grimes, he's got Bingham there as well. It's still Toby Edson. And out of play for the goal kick. Williams. King. Jacobs. Will Grigg. Grigg with the shot. And couldn't make the save. Will Grigg with the final. Chesterfield get a shot on goal. With 22 minutes. We're halfway through this first half. Williams gets it away. Rakish Bingham again. Sterling James in for Polian. Dominic Polian's chance. Harry Tyler made the dive. It's going to be a goal kick. The goalkeeper didn't touch it. Mandeville. Jeff King once more. The opening seems to have gone for a moment. Well, that's a great ball from Jacobs. Mandeville is deflected. And he's in the back of the net from Will Grigg. Will Grigg puts it over the line. There's Jacobs playing the ball in. Mandeville with the shot. And it was deflected. There's no doubt about that. But Will Grigg was on the end of it to get his 19th goal of the Chesterfield season King wanting it out here on the right hand side Tyra goes the other way instead plays it short to Grimes now Horton space for Horton to run down that left hand side played into Grigg coming a bit deeper for it Will Grigg who now makes the run forward dragging a defender with him Mandeville that's a great ball out to King Jeff King now Grigg wanting it inside the box. Jeff King gets past two opponents. It's still Jeff King. King with the shot. Great save. And by the back of the net from Dobra. Armando Dobra puts the spotlights in front in the 34th minute of the game. The hard work, though, was all done by Jeff King. King beat two, two defenders. Made room for the shot. Hits it with his left foot. Great football from Jeff King. But when the ball bounced up, I think of the goalkeeper, it was a man or double that banged it home. And Chesterfield have a 2 1 lead now. Jeff King, oh, good skill by King, getting past Kenlock. King to Mandeville. Mandeville on his wrong foot. Naylor. Mandeville to King. Jeff King this time with a chance. Again, he didn't take the only when he was there, I don't think. King plays it wide, Jacobs puts it in this time. And the header, just wide in the end. Josh Wright once more, the absolute captain, running into trouble in the form of Jacobs in the end. Given away to Jacobs, great chance here. Will Grigg took his time, Grigg again. And Cummins did really well. Mark Cummins did really, really well there. First of all, to save the shot from uh, Will Grigg. And then Dobra coming in at the back post, and he managed to deny him as well. Played into Franklin Domi, the other substitute that uh, was made at half time. Edsa plays it back to right. Josh Wright, the captain, plays it short again. And now Domi. Franklin Domi, chance there to shoot. He didn't really take it. 
laid off by Edson. Chapman with the ball in, and Ben Chapman has equalised for Epsley United. Not quite as quickly as in the first half, but Epsley have scored again early on in the half. 49 minutes on the clock. Uh, Franklin, uh, D Franklin Domi also had an opportunity to shoot and he's on the ball again now Franklin Domi playing that one through to Bingham played inside once more to Edsa a little back heel from Edsa Domi, chance here for McQueen Darren McQueen with the shot and Harry Tyler makes the save Epsley get the corner kick Horton looking to get the cross in this time but it's too long from Horton not a great cross Williams oh Polian got the better of uh, Bingham rather got the better of that Rakish Bingham now for Dominic Polian there's a great chance here for Epsley to take the lead and Polian oh well done Jamie Grimes Polian lifted it over Harry Sider and Jamie Grimes saves the day clearing off the line there from the ever menacing Will Grigg ready to make his run Mandeville with the ball in Grimes won the header it drops for Naylor Naylor couldn't find room for Tur to turn and shoot and when he did it was blocked Oldacre comes out to Jacobs Michael Jacobs with the cross into the six yard box and Tyrone Williams puts it over the crossbar Chapman Chapman gets past Grimes Ben Chapman, McQueen Darren McQueen with a great chance here, the shot from McQueen, saved by Tyler. Horton, everybody back here for Ebsfleet, Berry, Ollie Banks, Banks to drive one, and straight down the throat to the goalkeeper Mark Cousins, got his body behind it, Kenlock and I, Kenlock and I think that will I'm surprised if that won't get a card. Berry. This game is very open now. James Berry running at the absolute defence. Berry with a chance. And Berry's shot was on target. But well saved again by Cousins. Well, he's back to goal. King. Spanarch needing to find some sort of an incision into this absolute defence. Mandeville stays strong, Mandeville shot off the crossbar from Liam Mandeville is that the opportunity that would have won them the game and now Wright absolutely striding forward again here there could be another shock on here as Wright plays it out wide Josh Wright the absolute captain appealing for a free kick there but not getting it and the referee Stuart Morland blows the final whistle here at the SMH Group Stadium, it's ended all square.